Okay, how are we doing everybody? So, in the background we got some Modern Warfare 3 Team Deathmatch and I'm using the ACR. Yes, I know, it's overpowered and everybody hated it in Modern Warfare 3. I never used it that much, I don't have it gold or whatever the highest, um, the highest camo is. I think it was gold, wasn't it? I don't use it that much, but sometimes you've got to do what you've got to do. You know, I will keep saying, if you can't beat them then unfortunately you've got to join them. So that's what I do here. So it's a nice gameplay. It's a bit of a change. And you know what? Last night um, I uploaded the video talking about certain things. And the gameplay I incorporated with that was a Call of Duty Ghost gameplay. Now, I kind of scrambled around my hard drive to find something to put on there. Because the stuff that I'd pulled off onto my USB sticks, the one USB stick that was actually the largest one, for some reason seemed to corrupt all my data. So every gameplay I had had no audio with it, which was quite weird. Um, so <laughs> I had to scrap about 50 gig of gameplays and various other things and some noob of the weeks and stuff like that. So I was quite disappointed about that, but hey, that's, uh, that's life. It throws challenges at you and you have to face them head on and deal with them. So yeah, I've been kind of scrabbling around trying to get other things. And I've been playing a, a lot of Call of Duty Ghost of late and I don't know why, I really don't know why. I don't know why I put myself through it, I genuinely don't. And I've been looking at your feedback on that video and people were like, it's Call of Duty Ghost, please, no more. You know, we don't want to see anymore. We're tired of this. Put something else on. Put some Modern Warfare 3, Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, Modern Warfare 2. Anything but this. And it's like the gameplay I uploaded, I think it was something like 26 for 3. So in retrospect, that's what? Just over an 8KD or something like that. So in Team Deathmatch, you would think that would be a fast-paced, non-stop action Call of Duty Ghost gameplay. But it really wasn't. It was kind of kill a guy, move around, look for a guy, struggle, move around, kill another guy, move around, look, struggle. Oh, it's just... It was dull, and I watched the gameplay back, and I was disappointed myself, trust me. I didn't upload it with any pride whatsoever. Even though the score was good, it just wasn't my thing. And this morning I turned on my um, I turned on my console, because I'll tell you what happened last night, actually. I was playing Ghost, and I found out the inconsistency now with Call of Duty Ghost is just beyond a joke. It's clear that Infinity Ward are never going to do anything with it. They're never going to patch any relevant things, and they're most certainly never going to give us those dedicated servers. My initial issue, what I have with Call of Duty Ghost, amongst other things, is that... It seems to me that I find a game, when I turn it on, I find a game and I go ham. You know, I go absolutely ham. It's a really good, fun-packed, action-packed game. Lots of kills, very little deaths, lots of streaks, some, you know, fancy clever bits maybe. I don't know, something that I can be proud of and, and sort of relatively enjoy. Nothing too spectacular. But then the game directly afterwards screws me over. And when I say screws me over, I mean screws me over. And the one thing I always do is I always check the lobby leaderboard before I join a game just to kind of gauge the um, opposition that I'm going to be playing against. And I always seem to have the highest KD. Now, I don't have the highest KD in the world. I know this. I've got a 2.40 KD. So I know there are a lot of people. There are people on my friends list that have got four plus KDs. But generally, I end up with the highest KD in my lobbies. So I would kind of gauge that when I'm playing against somebody with an 0.50 KD who's sixth or eighth prestige that I'm going to kind of do better than them. However, it's not the case. Like I say, the first game, yes, I do. I walk all over them. The second game, it's almost like I literally cannot see them. You know, I can't deal with them. They're too fast. I've got all the faster perks. My All my class setups are pretty much a copy and paste. And I can't seem to ma outmatch them when they're using things like Incognito and the slower perks. So, yeah, I got very frustrated last night and I did something very silly. I took my controller and instead of bouncing it off the floor, I proceeded to smash it against my forehead <laughs> continuously for about five times. And it sobered me up, it made me feel dizzy. I was angry with the fact that I did that. I completely bust my controller to bits, which meant that I then went outside in a slightly still drunken rage and threw it down the street, which is very, very stupid. And um, I'm not proud of that one little bit. So. I woke up this morning and I thought, I can't do this anymore. This is just insane. I cannot put myself through playing this game. It's just horrible. It's an infected fucking game. It bores me. It bores me to tears playing it. And the only reason I play it is to get footage to upload. Because in my mind, I thought that, that maybe that's what people wanted to see. And it turns out that it isn't. So, you know, I played Modern Warfare 3 this morning. This gameplay was taken this morning. It was the first game I played when I turned my console on. And I had a blast. You know, I had such a good time for about 9, 10 games after till I turned my console off. I had an absolute blast. I played um, a little bit of Black Ops 2 soon afterwards. You know, I'd done a few bits and pieces, put Black Ops 2 in. And I had a blast. You know, I got a kill confirmed gameplay, which was about 72 kills in it. It's just so much fun, and Call of Duty Ghost is not fun, it's dull, and I get it, I get that people don't really want to watch it, 
You've got to ask yourself a question. This morning there was 29,000 people playing online on the Xbox 360 of Call of Duty Ghosts. Black Ops 2, there was 50,000. <laughs> what does that tell you? I know people might say, yeah, but a lot of people are playing Titanfall now. Titanfall's the big thing. Maybe it is, but I don't think it actually is as big as we all think. And bearing in mind, people on the Xbox 360 don't have Titanfall yet. That sort of tells you a little story in itself. People are kind of veering away and they're playing the older games like Modern Warfare 3. And that seems to be why it's a lot more playable because you're getting into local lobbies because there are so many more people playing these games. And that's immense because they're just so much more fun and they're much more fun to upload. And I actually sit back and watch these gameplays and think, yeah, I think people will enjoy that. I think people will have a nice time watching the gameplay if they're listening to the commentary. I know a, a few people said I just turned the I turned the gameplay off, I was doing something else, but I listened to the commentary. I don't want that. I want people to enjoy the whole experience in itself. So I've got your feedback guys. I totally understand. Thanks for giving me the feedback. You know I don't take offence to it. I try to take it on board and do what I can. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the gameplay. Have a good weekend. Apocalypse done.